Hello YouTubers, I'm Connor Arm, CEO, bringing in Arrow, Season 4, Episode 5, The Haunted. <laughs> Suddenly two guys find landmines and a bunch of drugs go missing. Yeah, Conklin, you got me. I didn't uh, wash up on shore here after a boating accident. I parachuted in on a secret spy mission. You want to die, a liar. That's fine. Yes. Enough. Enough. There are more pressing matters at hand. Perhaps if you were focused more on external threats rather than witch hunts, you would have caught this man spying on us in the field. Oh, I wasn't spying, mate. <laughs> Constantine. Well, let's go to cigarettes. The inn at CNRI when I was completely lost. Even Captain Lance, okay, he has been there for us since Mom died. Okay, but your point? My point is that pretending that you don't know who your friends are, it just doesn't feel very united. So it's very, very distant and cold. We have a PA system. Yet another decision I might live to regret. Hi, what's going on? Code 47 at a nightclub on 9th, a blonde woman going cray-cray, and since I'm down here, it's probably the blonde woman we've been looking for. Uh, the woman who's killing people in Pennington. Suit up. Yeah. Oh, that's, that's, oh, this, this, this is, this, this is, this is good. Oh, I know what the problem is. Thea. She's looking for girls that look like Thea. Would you two spend your spa weekend in Nanda Park? It's the only place we could get a reservation. The bloodlust is worse with Sarah, isn't it? Because you brought her back from death. Yeah, and that's not the only problem. Sarah's not herself. She's changed. Why didn't she come to me with this? Come to you for what? Your expertise with magical resurrection? Or that judgmental look on your face? For help finding her, Laurel, before she gets hurt or she hurts anyone else. And if I have a judgmental look on my face right now, it's because you play with forces that you do not understand. And now people are dying because Just of that she's only killed muggers and street thugs. I still can't That's believe because that Sarah. they all look resemblance to of Thea. Yeah. She's alive. I mean, I know how it's possible, I mean, but look. How? The Red Hood and the Joker. That's the last person he saw before he died. Complicated place that most people are comfortable That's a reaction mechanism. I received an old message from Ray. In the moment right before he died. I almost didn't listen to it because... I don't, I don't want to feel that grief again. The threat of zombie apocalypse aside, isn't it kind of nice not having to deal with the pain of saying goodbye? Well, if we're that simple. Except he's not dead. He's not a day goes by that I don't the the left person. miss my parents or Tommy. Jesus, it's been a while really since you talked about Tommy. We give just to spend another minute with them. But what's happening with Sarah? Well, if you bumped into Martian Manhunter, he can give you that promise. Healing pain is just making it worse. She almost killed those two girls in Eden. Why would she even go after them? Her marble collection's a little incomplete. Just guessing. Well, they have something in common. Well, 
may have the resemblance of was Stephanie Thea. Davis and the girl at the club was Lindsay Paulson. Oh my god, both these girls, they look like Thea. Oh my god. Oh, you have a lot of nerve. Thank a lot god. of nerve. Well, come with me. A lot of nerve. All this is your fault. Is Thea okay? No. Not only is Thea hospitalized, but she has Merlin influencing her to kill people. What are you talking about? Oh, just another thing that happened on your secret trip to Nandaparbat. Hey. I didn't tell you that I took my sister to Nana Parbat because I knew that you wouldn't approve. Why didn't you tell me you took Thea? What does that have to do with anything? It's the hypocrisy that I can't stand. What? It's okay for you to do whatever you have to for your sister, but it's not okay for me to do the same to mine. Sarah was dead. Thea wasn't nice. It's no accident that you're here. But I guess... Do not enter. More like... Only for the pure of heart. That's not you, mate. What the hell else is in that island? There you are, my pretty girl. And he knows a girl. <laughs> I can do that trick too. Clever <laughs> boy. I'd usually be more artful, but I'm on something of a clock. Shh, Joy! I'm not a bad guy either. As soon as you get off, he's the green arrow. Yeah, I take that back. Oh, what this time the page is off? Oh, what do you have? Damn tricks to do, to call. <laughs> Oliver, John, it's been a dog's age, mate. What? Dog's you age, that mate. favor you owe me? I oh, hardly expect you to let me forget that. How quickly can you get to Star City? I need you to be ready. All right, then. On with the show. This is going to be interesting. Canary is born! 
Good. Thank you, John. I owe you one. I believe I owed you one, mate. How's about we just call it even, eh? How about any time, anywhere you need me, I'll be there. I'll take that. You know, the head on the back of my neck has been standing up since the moment I got into town. That is probably our current problem, Damien Dark. Oh, you've heard of that. Oh, uh, yeah. You watch yourself at all that one, mate. You make what you saw in the other realm look like a bloody gnat. Any helpful advice? Yeah. Leave town. While you still can. I think it's that wow. bad. He's a very specific kind of young. Oh, I never did. I didn't hear you just see that. Yeah. Goons like Ryder, they're only interested in the sparkly bits anyway. The real power is in the spell. Yeah. Yeah, I'll show you. That was originally his? Lift up your shirt, mate. That tattoo was originally from him? What did you just do? I gave you some insurance against Ryder. And when the time comes, you'll know how to use it. Now I believe that concludes our business. I, uh, I, I need you to punch me in the face. Right. My uh, escape attempt left the bruise, right? Alright. I must warn you, I've got a hell of a right hook. <laughs> probably aren't the best use of this limited bandwidth. What I need you to know is I'm alive and I'm in trouble. Well, that episode is extremely interesting. One, Sarah was nearly killing people that had the exact resemblance of Thea, just like in Batman Under the Red Hood where Jason had one focus and that's to get his hands on the Joker and kill him but only if the Batman was there to witness it or try to, uh, to, to witness it or try to stop him but other than that the whole thing with Sarah and Laurel and uh, Thea and Oliver just made them be closer together and it was an awesome experience even though I didn't watch his show which I probably didn't get the chance to because I've been hearing a lot of good vibes and a lot of bad bad vibes because it keeps because hearing mixes of it actually makes me want to stop to watch the show. But it was awesome seeing uh, John Constantine in action, which was amazing, and the way he does his reverse exorcism and reincarnation spells in that type of language was very interesting to listen to. And uh, now knowing that uh, John Diggles' brother was in something too deep involved in the Hive doesn't mean he was part of Hive and he was going rogue on them by uh, working with the other side to give them information. And John knows about Damien Dark and he's actually quite like he's been messing, he's been messed with him before. And now there's two canaries into the Team Arrow, which means there's going to be another cabinet with her uniform written on it. But it's going to come to a point where Sarah notices that she took up the mantle so there's not going to be any room for the for Team Arrow to have two canaries. Well you have the canary but you also have the black canary so pretty soon the, the yin yang is going to begin between the black and the white canary and that's when the story comes forth for the legends of tomorrow and uh, let's see and knowing that Ray Palmer is alive and something tells me that he is way in too deep and somebody must have caught up to him around the time uh, he accidentally uh, shrunk himself and claimed to be dead and I uh, knowing that that poor guy drunk like over a dozen say about 13 of those energy drinks and he was crashing pretty hard and this episode got really really interesting and I can't wait to see how uh, this goes on before the mid-season final, before the Christmas holidays start. So that is my reaction and review, and I will see you on Thursday night with Supergirl. So all YouTubers and YouTubers, I'm Connor RMCEO, signing out. <laughs>